4. Clickable YouTube links, enable advanced settings, ensure proper URL format with HTTPS, avoid copying links from video description, and avoid adding links in channel description text. Solution 1. Adding URLs in YouTube Shorts According to YouTube's official policy on external links, URLs placed in Shorts comments, Shorts descriptions and YouTube live chat on mobile are not clickable. While links in your Shorts are not clickable, a workaround is to place important external links in the Shorts comments and guide your viewers on how to copy and paste them into a mobile browser, as I have shown in this example. On computers too, users can easily select the links in Shorts comments and right-click to open them in a browser or simply by copy-pasting in a browser. Therefore, you should include essential external URLs in the Shorts comment section. Solution 2. Adding URLs in YouTube long-form videos. To include URLs in comments and descriptions of long-form YouTube videos, you need to enable advanced features. Open YouTube Studio on your computer by clicking your channel profile picture and select YouTube Studio. Next, navigate to Settings, Channel, Feature Eligibility, Advanced Features. Follow the prompts to enable the intermediate and advanced features. This typically involves verifying your phone number and identity. If you lack a computer, check this description for a link to watch my tutorial on enabling advanced features with a mobile phone. Solution 3. Ensure proper URL format. Avoid adding external URLs on YouTube without the HTTPS prefix. You can see the difference between the two same links. One is blue and the other is not. The upper URL in my video description is broken and not clickable due to the mistake of lacking HTTPS security protocol. However, once I added HTTPS colon slash slash, my website URL became blue, clickable, and functional. Therefore, steer clear of this common mistake. Solution 4. Avoid copying links between videos. Avoid copying links from one video description and placing them in another video's description, as YouTube may truncate the URL. For example, if I copy the truncated link from the active description of this video and paste it back into the same video's description, you'll notice that the complete URL does not appear. I saved it for demonstration purposes. Now, when I check the links in the live video description, you can notice that both URLs apparently look the same, yet the one below is actually truncated. The above URL works fine and opens the page. However, clicking on the below URL will not lead to the intended page. Rather, it will lead the user to the website homepage because the link is broken. Therefore, always copy links from the original source before entering into a video description. Solution 5. Adding links to your channel's about section. Do not include links in your YouTube channel's about section description. You can observe that the URL in the description text of my YouTube channel is not clickable, but the other URLs in the links section are functional and clickable. To add external links to your channel in YouTube Studio, go to the Customization section. Scroll down and enter your external social media links. You can easily add up to 14 social media profile links here. For mobile phone, you can get the tutorial link in the description of this video. On number 6 are some bonus tips. You can see that I have added an external link in my video card. To activate links in video cards and end screens, you must join the YouTube Partner Program, which requires having 500 subscribers and 3,000 watch hours. Finally, for working and copyable links of video chapters, use timestamps in the correct format as shown on my screen. Please subscribe to the Dozro channel for excellent learning content and show your support for my efforts. Thank you for watching and liking this video.